Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to this video. Now it's the final day of the Assist Bubblegum of um, Toriamon Assist um, Soul, like Assist Shard, should I say? Now, as I said in my first video uh, two days ago, I did say that I'm not going to be going for um, this, but somehow I ended up using up around almost 1,854 diamonds. Yeah. <laughs> So because of that, I'm gonna I'm gonna get up to 2,888 diamonds. Uh, I already have 28 assist uh, souls of Turimon here. Personally, if I can get another 20 here, that's 48. Plus, if I can get a little bit, a little bit from here, obviously I'm gonna go for the rewards here. That's two there. That's 20 of these senior assist souls as well. I wanna get for these. So I'm gonna go on ahead. I'm gonna purchase this for now. So only one t once though, only like 10 times. Yeah. So there we go. Alright, so we got two, two of this there, so that's four, and then another three there, that's seven. That's pretty good, actually, it's not bad at all. Obviously, we got one Turimon shards as well, and one purple assist chip box shard. Okay, so I have 26, and we need we need 50 of these to get purple assist chip box. Okay. Alright, so anyway, the reason why I did that is because obviously I want to get these rewards from here, and as nice as these ones over here sounds, I just don't want to spend too much diamonds because so far you can you guys can see that I have spent yeah so basically 2,500 diamonds already. So we need to spend another 350 diamonds. So obviously it's gonna be 100 diamonds over here. Uh, the other 100 diamonds, I'm not sure how I'm going to spend them, but probably in my case, most likely I'll probably spend those diamonds in the guardian section. Uh, I'll try to upgrade my guardian as much as I can, but uh, for now. Let's go and do our daily stuff. Also, guys, how many uh, diamonds did you manage to guys spend for the for this event? How many diamonds did you spend? Uh, did you guys go for Turiamon over here? Did you go for the assist shards, or did you guys try try to get like this um, cumulative uh, recharge or exchange, for example, extraction? Now, obviously, if you guys notice here that you, you do have exclusive Turiamon assist here. So it says transfer the absorb fury to one random back row Digimon. Now it does here say here only one random back row Digimon. But obviously if you have uh, I think it's if you have awakened weapon with this uh, Cherubimon, you can transfer um, fury to like three random back row Digimon. Sorry, three back row Digimon. And increase fury recovery rate of all back row Digimons. Effects last for up to two rounds. Oh that's pretty nice. Anyway, I highly suggest you guys check out the uh, assistance skills of uh, Cherubimon before you uh, actually actually get him, because it's kind of, it's really important that you check out the assistance skills, not just like a skill like one, two, three, but click on oh wrong one. All right, let's go on preview. Obviously, you want to go all the way, scroll all the way down. So if you got red plus two here, obviously it's gonna be very hard to get into red plus two. But look on, for example, let's say from okay white, you unlock assistance skill green. Unlock number one, chip slot, green plus one. So, dispel the debuffs of one random control Digimon except Exile, Judgment, Seal, X. Okay, and then plus one more. Deal additional 30% damage to skilled Digimons. And uh, number two, chip slot, and then decrease 200 fury of one random target being attacked. So, it does say here in order to decrease fury, guys, you need to get it to purple plus one. And then change the skill hit area to enemy back row Digimons. Oh well, this is this is interesting. Okay, so basically with this assistant skill, it doesn't actually hit the front row, but this changes it to hit the back row enemy Digimon. So this would be a very good combination to you guys who have like a back row killer, especially if you have um, how should I say, if you have what's, what's that guy's name? Um, like Beelzemon for example, um, Machine Dramon, or if you have. What's that? Oh, I can't remember that one. There's another Digimon that attacks the back row and I really can't remember the name of it. So we have here increase additional damage to skill type Digimon by 60%. All targets within hit area lose 200 fury. Ooh, this is nice. So this is the one you want from Toriamon, okay? So keep that in mind. And also, um, genetics. You want to check the genetics too, guys. Like, check the preview section as well. So obviously if you awaken this one here, Royal Striker, when enemy has four or more Digimon remaining, increase self-control rate by 20%. That's pretty cool. And then over here. Ooh, 
Wield position laser to cast jewel. What? Position? Oh my god, I'm, I'm in the wrong. Um, uh, I'm in the wrong one. Okay, okay, that was my mistake. I was in the wrong one, man. So basically, while three great angels danger mode, one can increase ultimate damage for angel by 10% for first round. Uh, that's pretty cool. If you look at the second one, for example, uh, so you have here. Also deal extra 70% damage to skill power Digimon and restore 150 fury for self. Look at that, that's also deal 70% extra damage. Wow. Uh, let me just have a look at Angemon over here because Angemon is an angel type Digimon as well. So Angemon is basically uh, increase ally to Rimon, Xvimon. Angelomon, Gargamon, Loimon, Aquilamon, Cyberdron, Gargamon, Digivolution Lines, Immune Control Rate by 20%. When more than three of the above mentioned Digimons are in battle, increase 10% ultimate damage two rounds. Wow. That's very good. If you guys want to combine this with Toriumon, that's very good as well. So use expanded. Uh, what we want to find out here is. Oh, here we go. Deal 60% extra damage to defensive enemy Digimon. If enemy has only one Digimon, increase damage by 50%. Wow. So this is ultimate skill here. Now it does say here ultimate ultimate deal single target damage strengthen effect 100% chance to decrease 500 fury with 35% chances to stun target for one round. Also increase revival rate by 50% and inherit previous fury after revival. Whoa, nice. That's pretty cool. Uh, assist wise of Anjuman, it does have an exclusive chip as well, guys. So look at that. So what it does is oh, what it does is basically exclusive assistant chip for Angemon series. It restores HP of one random Digimon, has a certain chance to revive the Digimon after the death. I, I kind of I like this one because he also restores HP and he also revives the actually has a small chance of reviving the Digimon after. That's pretty cool. Uh, but obviously you want to check out the previews over here, see what's available. Now you have have 30% chance of stun target for one round, two targets at, at most. So this is like a, you would say that this is kind of like an upgraded, upgraded a Cubimon. If you have a Cubimon as a free to play uh, player, then this one is more like a upgraded version. Uh, for every 16 quality or above Digimon you have on the field, increase assistant skill damage by 1.5. Oh wow, so this is like really good. Obviously a lot of players right now have probably potential 16 or even potential 17 teams. So it says your target being attack has an additional 80% chance to lose 300 fury. Ooh. Okay, okay. I mean these these skills are really like fury controller. That's really nice. I'm gonna stop there <laughs> because we're not talking about Anjuman today. Today is Turiamon lessons. All right. So material exchange. No. Uh, this recharge. I haven't recharged. Sale stuff, guys. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I did buy this. Yeah, I bought this already. Oh, okay. So it looks like I'm gonna be spending 100 extra points over here today. Nope, nope. No. Okay, maybe a little bit of a gold touch as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a bit once, twice. Let's go with three times, four, five. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave it there for now. All right, let's get this free gift over here. And also, I have to claim my rewards from uh, last weekend because I haven't actually claimed them yet. I've been so busy. Uh, okay, so we got ores. We got oh, we got eight tower cannons there. Thank you very much. Oh, that's for because of the tamer contest. That's why. That's why we get all these uh, rewards right now, guys. Because if you notice, the tamer contest season has finished. Uh, fist fighting as well. Uh, also, I think what was else was there? Plus our mine war rewards too. Guild coins, we got 1280 diamonds there. I noticed I got 9 million gold as well, that's pretty cool. Okay, so just to show you guys, I was talking about like a tamer contest is. Um, come on, where are you, tamer contest? Not that one. It's gotta be somewhere. Uh, maybe maybe it's not enough room to keep all of it, so it's, it's gone right now. Okay, anyway, all right, let's leave it at that. Uh, let's go on to breed section, guys. Core of the Guardian. So, it looks like we can upgrade this. Now, let me just make sure I'm upgrading the correct one because this says the requirements for the next one is Last Blessing needs to reach level 15. 
on one Digimon whose assistant quality reach orange. Oh, that's gonna be so hard. If you're free to play, that's gonna be so hard. Anyway, that's so level 13. Now we go to level 14. If you guys would notice, that requires 2 million gold. Wow. Wow, was there 2 million gold, yeah? Uh, what else? We got breed over here. Let's, let's get that. Okay, uh, fusion. Okay, let's exchange. What? Oh, I don't have enough World Greymon shards. Okay. Uh, Digimetal. Now, talent points, guys. So far, I have 21 talent points. It's just, I couldn't do this yesterday because I, I didn't have enough gold. So I was kind of stuck. But anyway, so we're going to upgrade this. So, promote defense of attack type Digimon. It's a very good option for me because I have two attack type Digimon in my front row. So this would help a lot. So let's go with 10 there. Okay, so that's going up to 2.8. Now it's 3% defense. Okay, nice. So that's 3% right now. If we can, if we can max this out up to uh, 13, that's going to go up to 6%. I can see here at 6% there. So that'll be nice to have 6% extra defense and also here as well 6%. That'll be very, very cool. Okay, uh, in the meantime, let's go over here. So guys, how far are you guys with your uh, divine weapon stuff? Okay, now what should we go here? Should we go with no, 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 no? Okay, we're gonna, I'm gonna stick with what it is like now. Yeah, let's leave it like that. Digimon Spirit. Okay, so we're gonna go on to quick complete over here. Okay, and finally, right after this now, I'm gonna go on to the awaken. Um, I'm going to go to Awaken Alloys because I have some equipment that I need to awaken on Jupiter Mon. Okay, so right now I have 51 Awaken Alloys. So it's going to be 16 over here. Let's awaken that. And then it's going to be 32 over here. So far I have 3 extra, which is really good for me. Okay, so let's awaken that. There we go. So HP is not much of a HP increase, to be honest, but still it's better to max this out, especially on my main team. And then after that guys, I have to max this out. If you guys are wondering why didn't I increase, I mean, I, I didn't awaken this, it's because this one only requires 16 awaken alloys, but this one over here required 32. It's more easier for us to get 16 awaken alloys than it is to get 32 awaken alloys. That's one of the reasons why. So obviously the next one to upgrade is gonna be this one here. Uh, in terms of, you know what, let's, Let's upgrade that, so there's 1 million there, oh wow, 2 million, wow, 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 okay, uh, I'm going to advance this, <laughs> yeah. If you guys notice that this, oh wait, the weapon here and also the uh, not the belt, they cost more gold compared to the leggings and the uh, breastplate, I mean the breastplate and leggings are like around 700,000 and 600,000, but obviously this one's a bit higher, but still. Uh huh. Rousing essence. Da -da -da. Who should we go with? Let's go with that's ah 94%. Okay, so let's get this a little bit higher. All right. So anyway, guys, let me know, guys, what do you actually prefer to like rouse over here? Obviously, it's not what you prefer, but in terms of arena and challenger tournament or guild battle. That's what the rouse in that section is for, is, is to give you higher stats in, like for example, this one here is Challenger Tournament, so is this. This one here is for Arena and Arena. This one is for Guild Battle and Guild Battle. So obviously they give you like chances of attack, HP and defense, higher stats. And obviously if you can get it to 100%, like I have here, for example, Grolmon's attack is, you have plus, that's 100, no, sorry, that's 12,800 attack points. That's a lot. But keep in mind that this only has effect in the guild, sorry, in the arena. Basically, I'll focus in on the arena for now. Oh, I saw that we have 99%. Was that 99? Oh, 99%. Okay, so now we're going to go times 10. So, 100, come on. Oh, wow. <laughs> 100? Oh, there we go, 100, okay. That's great, so obviously we can focus on HP and defense because my Grolmon really dies so, so flipping fast. And obviously I'm pretty sure you guys would agree with me too. He has huge amount of like damage, but he dies really, really fast.
similar to uh, Omnimon. <laughs> Alright, so we got 43% there. Now we're gonna get how much? 45 hopefully, or 15? 47, I see 47 here. 48. Okay, we got 48, exactly 48%. Now give us 50, give us 50. Oh, I saw 52 there. I saw another 52. I see, okay, 52 I think, yeah, 52, even though it's going so fast, yeah, I can still like pick up on, I see 55 there, oh, I see 60, 65, ooh, 66, ooh, nice, okay, 60, oh, that's 65, oh, 66.1, okay, that's great, let's get this all, I'm gonna try to max these out, guys, like, literally, max, 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 uh, so we're almost out of arousing essence very soon, so 70 points there, or sorry, sorry, 70%. Now I have to, if you guys don't know, uh, obviously this rousing area is, is in terms of arena, guild battle and um, challenger tournament, but make sure you pick the right one, which one you want, because if you guys focus on arena, you want to get the arena buffs over here, you want to get the arena extra stats, this way you can have higher stats, you can improve better, get a higher ranking. So obviously the higher ranking you have in Arena, the higher the rewards and of course the higher diamonds you're going to get for the Arena. That's one of the reasons why I'm focusing on this. Obviously I'm not a whale so uh, I can't really focus too much on it. Uh, anyway, alright let's go back. Uh, da -da -da. Challenge. Oh yeah, let's get some gold from here. That's 5 million gold, thank you. Da -da 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 -da. Wait. We got two Capitaria shards there. Okay, I guess it's shards I don't even need, but... Yep, 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 yee. By the way, guys, today is the final day of the uh, Guild Dungeon. Obviously, it's the 31st. Um, unfortunately, last night, I literally saw this. That we, we went up to 97%, um, okay? We went up to 97% and... We like we couldn't pass it because there was a few of uh, our guild members didn't actually do the guild instance. So yeah, that was really downside. I was pushing everyone, but still, we're missing out on hundred diamonds and also hundred fifty of energy potions and spar chests. I was very disappointed to be honest. But anyway, if we didn't pass it today or this month. We were definitely going to pass it next month, definitely. But make sure you claim these rewards, guys. I'm gonna like do a spare videos on these. That's why I'm not claiming them right now. Um, yeah, so I can't wait for that. And also, just to guys, to, just to let you know, guys, tomorrow we're going to have cross server arena. Are you guys ready for this? Are you looking forward to it? Because I am, obviously, because I want to get the um, where's the shop over here? Where's the reward? I can't see the rewards right now, but obviously, I want to access the shop here and the, um, the rewards from there. That's gonna be pretty cool. Very very nice rewards. Let's go into shop over here. Ooh, thank you very much. Actually, um, I just realized we have so much points there, so I'm going to buy that. I mean, if I save all these points, I can probably buy one of these. To be honest, I'm, I'm kind of thinking right now, maybe I should save to buy one of these uh, Digivice chests. I think so. But it's going to be a random one, so that's a downside to it. <laughs> maybe, maybe not for now. Alright, Crusher Mine War. So let's buy this. Alright, we're gonna buy, buy. Alright, let's get this, get that. So obviously it's Wednesday today, uh, obviously another two, three more days and we can get, uh, we can do Crusher Server Mine War all over again. And, uh, <laughs> and to be honest, in two days that's when I get married as well, so uh, I gotta make this. Uh, I won't have a lot of time to play this game. Now let's let me get some of that. Uh, what else we got here? Let's get this. Let's get that too. Okay. Okay. So yeah, that's our daily stuff almost done, guys. Uh, let's claim this. Ooh. Also, let's. What we got here? All right, thank you, Angel Woman. Now we can do a little bit of a fusion of Angel Woman. Just get some more shards here. So we got six Angel Woman shards. We can get three Mastermon. 261, 62, 263, 264. 
Okay, so we are 100 shards away left from Anjo uh, Massimo on 7 stars. Wow, this is taking a long, long time. Or as, as I saw an advertisement in Japan, it's like, long, long, man. <laughs> oh my god, funny advertisement. Anyway, uh, alright guys, I'm gonna leave it there, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave your comments down below. If you have any questions... Oh no, I just made a mistake. Why did I just buy that? I didn't want to, but... Uh, oh, that was delicious. Stupid mistake. Anyway, that's minus 25 diamonds from me. Oh my god. I got distracted there. I literally... Oh no. Uh, let's just wipe out there once. Twice. Oh man. What we got here? Lucy, those who are blasphemous to pride will be exiled outside the light. After the resurrection, Lucy becomes more tyrannical. Watch out for the exile. Oh my god. I mean, Lucy is already tyrannical already, so. Whoops. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have gone on automatic battle, but. Yeah. La 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 la. So Lucimon has invincibility effect. We got we got oh we got Omnimon there the uh, skin mode. Wow. Now oh my god. I wonder if Fury Down works on these. I'm gonna give it a try. I hope it works. Let's go with Fury Down. Now from what I noticed on the description is like we have to take out Lucimon first. But also, he is literally invincible from a uh, uh, Venusmon um, skill. Anyway, there's no way I'm gonna pass this. You watch how quick I'm gonna die. Oh my god. He released ultimate skill. Uh oh. Oh, oh. Oh, Fury, Fury down, where? Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 Oh, this guy's gonna do a lot of damage. Watch this, watch this, guys. Oh, oh, I got KO'd. Oh, oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did, did you guys just see in Praljamon's, like, what just happened? His health was, like, obviously it was going down, and then just, poof, he went high, and then he just KO'd. Wow. Anyway, um, that's his epic fail, uh, <laughs> Uh, very very epic fail. Okay, uh, let's <laughs> let's skip this. I mean, you can you can give this a try as much as you want, but um, oh, it's dead. It does it doesn't cost anything to give it this this uh, extra stage a try, like over and over again. I don't know why I'm even carrying on here because it's clear to say that watch this guy now. Let's see how much damage he's gonna do. We're gonna KO. Oh, he didn't KO me. Oh wow, that's weird. I mean, the description said that he's gonna like exile higher and huh? Yeah, epic, 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 epic fail. Okay. Uh, anyway, as I was saying, guys, I'm gonna leave it at that. <laughs> I don't want to. I literally have to. Yeah, I have, to, I have to go right now. Uh, I've got to go get some stuff and get ready. Okay, uh, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Uh, see you next time.